Welcome back, everybody. I am the Eagle Fan. This is my channel. I am going to react to some music today. This is New Skinned. And the song is Edmund Kemper. Now, knowing how their videos are and knowing that they always go with serial killer type songs, I had to look up Edmund Kemper, and now I kind of wish I didn't, although it's good to see how much of a monster he is, and is, I guess, still serving time, and to be honest with you, he serves, he serves no purpose in this society. Edmund Kemper, an American serial killer who murdered 10 people, although... I think it's more than 10 because he murdered people before he was quote unquote a serial killer. So I don't know how that calculation works out. Kemper murdered a 15 year old girl as well as his own mother and her best friend from May of 72 to April of 73. This was after Kemper was on parole for murdering his parental grandparents when he was 15 years old. He, he should never see the light of day, ever. He was nicknamed the co-ed killer as most of his non-familial familial victims were female college students hitchhiking in the vicinity of Santa Cruz County in California. <sighs> He's a tall SOB at six foot nine. And here's where the disturbing parts, not that it's already not disturbing. Most of his murders included necrophilia and some included the R word. This guy's a monster. An utter monster. Wow. He was released at the age of 21. This was after he was, after he'd already killed his grandparents. He convinced the psychiatrists that he was rehabilitated. I. He should never see the light of day ever again. He should have never seen it back then. Way to go, psychologist, psychiatrist. I hope the psychiatrists who fell for his BS are were no longer psychiatrists after that. Anyway. Sorry, I'm going to get off my little um, soapbox here. I do apologize. I just needed to have an idea of what we were going to be looking at. Let's get over to this other screen, shall we? I do apologize. I realized I was clicking things earlier before I did that transition. Transition. Let's hear some skinned. It isn't that impossible in this society. It happens. It happens. It happens. It happens. It's already got the creep factor. That's good. One of these days, gonna follow through. Seppel in the brain, and I don't know what I'll do. Here's a little game, here's a deja vu. Bury your own Harriet, looking up at you. This is what you got, this is chemistry. A kettle on a stove's always gonna make a tea. A sticker on a hood, a chubby and a key. Are you fucking kidding me?
Okay, before it gets into this next little section. I really liked her voice in there. Now I know many people know who she is, but I'm not going to say the name here. I'll kind of respect her attempt at privacy with this group. Love her voice. She does this creepy so well. Not with the singing. The singing was great. That was her voice. It's just she's got a very good voice. It's just that everything is so eerie. You don't always see that. I should say you, you're many times you're concentrating more on this insane event that she's singing about that maybe you don't quite pick up the voice. And I've seen some stuff that she sang under her own name. And I was very impressed. But let's go back. Let's hear some more. Eeny, miny, mo, can't watch him grow. Chicken or the egg, or I guess it's kind of slow. What about the kitten that I buried in the yard? Should have seen it coming, should have known it from the start. Ship me out of granny like a leopard to the sea. I'm a double whammy and I'm gonna make it free. Better take a test, better wait and see. Are you fucking kidding me? I can't stop! Just a little. I realized I was just sitting here getting into it, watching, didn't have another pause. Hopefully that doesn't affect me too badly. It's there's such a a struggle inside. Really like hearing her voice. Very entertained by what she does. But then also thinking about the stories behind it. And this just evil piece of garbage human that she's singing about it tears you up you know, there, there's that struggle between enjoying the art and then also knowing what we're talking about here there's some sick people out there anyway let's finish this up <laughs> Oh. 
I'm sorry. I guess we were at the end there. I wasn't sure if there was going to be another drop. I'll let the credits roll a little bit here. Okay. Let's go over to the other screen. There we go. That was disturbing. Very disturbing, but also, I gotta say, I absolutely loved her, her voice when she was just letting it shine during those little moments. This, I mean, it's really hard to say. It's hard to judge and list a skinned song as, oh, this is my favorite, that's my favorite, just because of knowing how serious the topics are and what kind of pieces of garbage are being sung about in most cases. I say in most cases because I think there's at least one song that's actually named after a victim, I believe. I thought I remember reading that somewhere. So I don't want to say in all cases because, you know, the victim's not. I don't want to put down any victims. Um, thoughts go out to anybody involved and, and affected by this. Granted, it was many, many years ago. But, you know, there's that little thread that gets pulled that you don't know how things progressed since then or would have progressed without this other monster. So that was skinned. That was that was skinned. I actually don't even want to say the name of the, the song on this when you see it on the screen. Because that monster doesn't really deserve to have his name on people's lips. It's good to know about because you need to know there are people like this out there. You need to be safe. You need to always mind your presence and who you're in the presence of. But anyway, I'm sorry. I'm going to try to take it a different direction now. Thank you guys for joining me. Please let me know down below. What are your thoughts on this song? What are your thoughts on Skin? What suggestions do you have? Hey, how was your weekend? Let me know that too. That's good as well. And if you are a fan of Skinned, what is your favorite Skinned song? This this one, just listening to it, if you're not knowing what the entire story is, I really absolutely loved her voice in this. So let me know your thoughts. And while you're down there, gotta say it, a like, comment, subscribe, click on that little bell if you want to know when I have a new video out. It's always appreciated. It's never pressured. So thank you guys again. Please be good to each other out there. We definitely need more of this. And the world's kind of in a crazy place right now. Stay safe and healthy. The world is a better place with you in it. You definitely matter. Keep your eyes to the sky because you never know what you might see. There might be another video. There might be just something amazing that if you were just staying in your own little tunnel vision, maybe you would have missed. You've got to be open to, to new things, new people, new experiences. And accepting of such. So thank you guys again. Please. Until next time. Take care everybody. Bye. <music>